This sounds like political presidential talk to me. I am officially running for president of the United States. I, w I would say that I would have a hell of a chance of winning. And we are going to make our country great again. Say what you will about uh, Mr. Trump. He certainly would bring some change to the White House. I could stand in the middle of Fifth Avenue and shoot somebody and I wouldn't lose any voters, okay? If Hillary Clinton were a man, I don't think she'd get 5% of the vote. You, Mr. Trump, recognize that the real problem was a lack of leadership. I don't know if I have it in me. I'm scared. I'm kidding. Let's do this. <laughs> First female president. First female president. Me, 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 me. Citizens, you will elect me. I will be your leader. Uh, I don't know what I said. Uh, I don't remember. We are overrun. If you do not get here soon, we're all gonna die. We had four dead Americans. Was it because of a protest or was it because of guys out for a walk one night who decided they'd go kill some Americans? What difference at this point does it make? Someone should get to the bottom of that. And I know just the guy to do it, Donald Trump. How willing are you to die for your country? I would bomb the out of him. I'm the worst thing that's ever happened to ISIS. I'd like to punch him in the face, I'll tell you. There's a fight going on down here. This is a very sad scene that we're seeing. I will build a great, great wall. I'm not going to pay for that Liberty. wall. And the wall just got 10 feet taller. You want to comment on whether the Clinton ticket has a relationship to a sexual predator? Did someone say women everywhere? We're going to have to leave it at that, and you can take your anger issues and spend some time working on them, Mr. Speaker. Deal with it. Oh well, back to square one.